The one whom is internationally accredited and it don't make a mark not only for Salon but for the world and the recognizer for a good work through the effort through the effort we don't succeed for a huge teenage pregnancy you will come back our first lady put your hands together for mother Thank you very much, Sanon. Boka kwa wide. Wide. Boka kwa no yari fine on wide. Wide. Okay. This is the make and shots because His Excellency they look forward to this football year. So I want for brick for owner. Of course. The SLPP presidential candidate, the man where don't make football, when they talk about football, the one where take Leo Star to the African Nations Cup, when it will be one of the NPRC guys them, and the one where decide again for make sure say Sierra Leone go to the African Nations Cup. The man where don't invest so much in football, where from where he come. He don't invest so much in football so that Sierra Leone Premier League will be one of the best in the sub region. The man where we did say football they bring unity in the country and the reason why he not they left anything unturn when it comes to football issues in this country because he no say whenever football they play, the country they be united. And in watch for letting the young star continue for do well, um, for make we go able for bring this country here together because football is peace, football is unity, and football bring us together. So at this juncture, please, ladies and gentlemen, help me welcome His Excellency, retired Brigadier Julius Manabio, the President of the Republic of Sierra Leone and the leader of the SNPP party, the Sierra Leone People's Party presidential candidate. Chairman of the Israeli People's Party, ministers, deputy ministers, heads of agencies and departments, our revered traditional leaders who are present here, football administrators, players, owners of clubs, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, it's a great pleasure to be here this evening. For me, football is more than just a game or a sport. It's about a passion to succeed. It's about working as a team. It's about empowerment of the young people. It's about persevering against all odds. And it is about uniting the nation, Sierra Leone. That is why we say one country, one people. Therefore, I'm delighted to be part of this football family to formally open the Southern Arena Stadium, which is the first privately owned football facility in this country. I want to commend Babadi Kamara for translating his passion for football into constructing his own infrastructure, which has not only given pride to the inhabitants of Holy Spirit, but also accorded the privilege, the prestige to a city fondly referred to as the second capital of our great republic, Sweet Home. In 2018, when the Australian People's Party government took over the reins, there was a serious decline in sport due to incessant conflicts among football stakeholders. No organized national league for over five years. No inter-football and athletics competition. 
lack of um, qualification in major international sporting competitions and low budget allocation. In the last five years, my government has invested almost 250 billion euros in sports, which has led to remarkable achievements. Our learning youth has participated in the African Cup of Nations tournament in Cameroon after an absence of 26 years when I was also absent from the public space. I handed over 26 years ago and until the time I came back 26 years after, that was when the youth started. I brought the key back. Hundreds of jobs have been created through the revival of the men's football Premier League and over 25 Syrian Union footballers have secured professional contracts with overseas clubs. That is remarkable, ladies and gentlemen. And for the first time in history, the women's our football Premier League was established successfully as concluded with the Maguemo, Maguemo Queens football club from home this week, imagine as the champions. It has to be won this week to the women. For the first time after decades, we financed and supported university athletics and officials in both the Africa and West Africa University Games in Ethiopia and Nigeria respectively. Syria Leon's women national cricket team, ladies Patrick, brought home the bronze medal in 2023 women's T20 international cricket tournament in Lagos. Syria Leon has achieved various successes in boxing, golf, wrestling, karate, swimming, tennis, and volleyball. Let me use this opportunity to thank our national players, athletes, coaches, technical teams and support and sport company bodies for their dedication and commitment not only to represent Syria Leone internationally but also successfully compete for medals. As President, I recognize that one of the major challenges we are confronted with is the inadequate or absence of standard infrastructure for all sporting disciplines. For instance, in 2021, when I hosted the FIFA presidential uh, president, Gianni Infantino, and the staff president, Dr. Patrice Bosope, we spoke about creating a solid partnership for investing in football infrastructure in Syria. I'm pleased that we are here in Mo to demonstrate that citizens too can support our infrastructure ambition to transform football in Sierra Leone. I'm also delighted to note that this new 6,000 all, all seater Southern Arena Stadium meets international standards. The stadium will not only the stadium provides not only opportunity for sports and recreation, but also gives young people the platform to exhibit their talents and skills. It will also contribute to expand the local economy and provide hundreds of football-related jobs. Let me also use this opportunity to thank the government of the People's Republic of China for, for, the, for the rehabilitation of the Sierra Stevens Stadium. The work is expected to complete in 2024, and upon completion, the Sierra Stevens Stadium will be one of the most modernized stadiums in Africa with impressive facilities. It is important to note that human capital development program is not just about formal education. It includes a formal sector which gives an opportunity to, for every young person to be equipped with the necessary skills to realize their potential. Therefore, this football facility contributes to the informal sector of our human capital development program. This uh, football infrastructure will also serve as a vehicle 
to promote equal opportunity for young people, regardless of their ethnicity, religion, religion, region, and political persuasion, to showcase their skills and their talents. As I conclude, let me say that football is about gamesmanship and not violence. It's about fair play and not cheating. It's about respect for the rule of law and also not holding anything. And it is about building the structures, structures and not vandalism. A good sportsman must have the magnanimity to celebrate victory and the courage to accept defeat. Each of you, whether as a player, spectator, supporter, or club owner, must play your part to protect this infrastructure and maintain its high standards. Let me end by sharing with you the words of former United States President John F. Kennedy, who once said, and I quote, ask not what your country can do for you, ask what you can do for your country. Today, Babadi Kemara has asked not what his country can do for him, rather what he can do for his country. He has given his country and the people of all districts a state-of-the-art 6,000 seater stadium. You too can give something to your country, regardless of whatever shape or form your generosity may take, because building the nation requires not just an individual, but the generation. On that note, let me declare this stadium, the Southern Arena Stadium, formally open, and I wish all participating teams good luck competing for the best trophy at this facility and hope the best team wins. As we officially commence election campaign in the coming days, let me also remind all that the 2024 the presidential election is a choice between the previous ABC government, which destroyed football and left sport in Japan, and the Syrian People's Party under my leadership, which has revitalized football and invested billion in sport. We have a choice to make, and the choice is all yours. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mr. President. Let us now rise for the national anthem. Let us rise for the national anthem, ladies and gentlemen. After the cutting of the tape, Madame Madame With great delight and honor, and now, commission, they start the marriage. Fatima Bio, Fatima Bio, Fatima Bio, Fatima Bio, Fatima Bio, Please, 
the teams that have come out now through the tunnel. So we're kindly asking that anybody who knows their business here now to kindly left the pitch. We're about to start the match now. His Excellency the President and Madam First Lady, they wait for kind of the kickoff. We're now calling on both teams to please come out and let us get this started. Only accredited photographers are allowed to be here. If you are not here, obviously, please let us leave. Team Only accredited photographers are allowed to be here. Now we say they can't push you If you are not please. Whilst we wait for the teams, don't forget the after party. Just at the car park of the Southern Arena, we have outstanding artists there who are prepare for perform. So the show is going to continue. After the match, we go to the car park. Put your hands together as we welcome both teams, the Rangers and Easter Lions. Please, let me left this area. Let all my come out inside the pitch, please. Thank you. We come out now. Only accredited cameramen, because they can take professional pictures. The rest, please, sir. Please. We wait now for the two teams that will come out. All right, no music, no music. We we'll still waiting on both teams. No, listen to me. What's the yeah, so where the yeah, where is that Yeah, where is that taking you to make? Don't let me force. His Excellency the President. Well, Excellency, Madam First Lady, are both going to set the stage. Today. His Excellency the President, Mr. Abigail Jilos Marabio, Commission, the Sultan Between and the Asmalisi, Mr. Abigail Jilos Marabio, 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 Mr. Abigail Jilos we can lock on Eastern Zion, the champion of today's Knights, Nadisa, Ayena, and the Sultan Ayena, His Excellency the President, the Zena Yashon now, we can do the kick off. On the top of the Southern Arena, for comments, we're still the start going to find out of this particular match. Lions, Lions, Lions is here in the red jersey representing Eastern Lions, the Killers. Eastern Lions, the Killers are out of the dressing room. We are now in the pitch. No Rangers. Let me clear this area, please. We're up against the players that line up. So His Excellency the President and when I first tell you who we keep up. Thousands of supporters. South Tal thousands of football loving fans. And they're presently in the South Tal Arena. You can witness this all important match between Bow Rangers and these 10 Lions. And of course, in a wait, for see His Excellency the President do the official kickoff of this all important game. The officials are here. His Excellency the President, and the first lady will present me. Let us put our hands together for. Bow Rangers in green, Eastern Lions in the air. We're now calling on the 
His Excellency the President and Madam First Lady, Imam himself, Abu Kome, Minister of Sports. President of the Sierra Leone Football Association, for a handshake. Please let us make way. Yes. 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 The handshake is on, led by His Excellency the President, Brigadier Retired GS Man of Your Excellency, Dr. Patima Jabi Bio. They are being accompanied by the Minister of Sports, who is only elected. President, Immediately after that, the handshake, we're going to see the kickoff to be executed by His Excellency the President along with her Excellency, Madam Fatima Bio. Right after that, the ball is going to be set rolling. And please be reminded that the after party is going to happen just outside this arena. As a matter of fact, around the car park. LXG. Cow, Foyer, and a whole lot of other artists are actually lined up for that event. So immediately after this match, don't go away. Stay back. We still have a lot more for you in store. Alright, we've just come to the end of the handshake. It's now time for the kickoff. Please listen. We don't know get business that they teach. Please come on and do it. I mean, how to tell us we have to say this. Only accredited photographers are allowed to stay within during the kickoff. Alright? So we don't want them who are poor photographers. Everybody, everybody, please let us leave the pitch. Please, let us leave the pitch. The kickoff is about to happen. The kickoff is about to happen. The kickoff that is the symbolic victory for the Stars against the Super Eagles of Nigeria is about to happen. We know what happens any time Haji takes a kickoff. The last time he took a kickoff, he led us to the African Cup of Nations. Today again, ladies and gentlemen, here he comes, accompanied by Madam First Lady, right foot What? Classic of the world. And that is classic. His Excellency the President. Say I'm Brigadier Julius Marabio. Just don't make that wonderful kick of the and you play a book. Ten 
minutes. It is. Has been given to the players for a quick warm up. Boy, Ten guys. minutes has been given to the players for a quick warm up. In the meantime, we're well, not get business now. Please, let's go out. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, let us now rise as we've come to the conclusion of uh, His Excellency's contribution here in the ceremony. We are going to take the national anthem. Let us all rise.